All right, let's welcome in Home Connect TV expert Corey Hastings of Ingo and Volkers. And Corey, man, oh man, what a year. Everyone says this year has been a hot year in real estate for Northeast Florida, to say the least, right? So tell us about the market recap, Corey. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you for having me. Um, it's probably been the greatest year ever uh, in real estate here in Northeast Florida. Um, Average sales prices are up 15% from this time from last year. Um, there's more homes being sold than ever. There's more people relocating than ever to, to Florida. Um, so it's a great time to be a seller because the inventory problem is still there. Um, and it's probably not going anywhere, which we'll get to in just a few minutes. Wow. Yeah. And, and really, I'm thinking, you know, this mark, we've never seen anything like this. You know, the Home Connect TV experts have been keeping us updated uh, throughout the summer with all the updates. And we say, oh my gosh, it continues to get crazier and crazier. So, how has dealing with COVID 19 affected the real estate market in 2021? Yeah, it's, it's been huge um, because now more people can work from home. More people, you know, want more space. And so a lot of people are upgrading. A lot of people are selling, um, but also more people are relocating here to Northeast Florida. Um, I think Jacksonville was a top 20 most moved to city in the United States uh, this year. And I think a lot of it is because people don't have to live in New York anymore. People don't have to live in California anymore. And so they're coming into our market and they're not afraid of paying really high prices. Um, which is just driving the prices up because like I said, inventory is the biggest problem that we have. Right, some good points there. And yeah, I'm seeing all the out of state license tags all around town. So uh, yes, yeah. what you're saying is true. Uh, forecasting into 2022. Okay, we're ready to ring in the new year. Do you think this market will continue to be this strong? I do, um, because the biggest problem that we have right now is inventory. And I joke all the time that nobody's just going to come into our market and drop 5,000 houses for sale. Um, anything in business or real estate is just all about supply and demand. The more supply you have, the less demand you have and vice versa. Right now, we have a lot of demand and not a lot of supply. And I don't think it's going to just get better overnight. It's going to take a 12 to 18 to 24 months, which looks like 2022 is still going to be a really strong market for everybody. All right, Corey, I appreciate it. So it's like a big ship and we're trying to turn it around. It's going to take some time, huh? Yeah, I mean, it, it, look, it's, these are all good things. Uh, unless you're really trying to buy a house right now, it, it can be a little difficult, but it's not impossible. If you have the right real estate agent, real estate advisor that can uh, drive you through that process. But look, if you're a seller and you're thinking about selling, it's probably the best time because right now you're sitting on a lot of equity. Um, like I said previous, homes that were purchased last year to this year are sitting on a minimum of 15% equity which is amazing for homeowners in our market. And so it's exciting times. It certainly is. And that's why we have the Home Connect TV experts to let us know the ins and the outs and exactly what to do. And we really appreciate you being with us here today. My pleasure. Happy holidays, everybody. Yes, for sure. And of course, uh, you can actually watch Home Connect TV on seven days a week. Make sure to watch it. All right. It has hundreds of homes for sale across the first coast.